Hiya, it's Jamie. On today's episode of Things I Would Tell My Sister, if she were still living with me, which she's not. Anyway, <laughs> high on the list is I am shocked. <laughs> it's not really the right word. Anyway, uh, to discover that you can turn right on a red arrow in Florida. As long as you come to a complete stop first, you can still turn. What's the point of having an arrow then? Why not just be a red light? I think that's crazy. Um, and at some intersections, they have a sign that says no turn on red. But for the most part, red arrow, you can turn. Weird. Uh, important for Sean, my son, to know that because he really has done most of his driving down here and it will be different when he goes somewhere else and that it's weird here. Um, number two is I'm getting tired of my shoes. I packed all of my shoes but for my sneakers and a, no, but for my sneakers, I bought the flip-flops since I was here. Um, on my moving truck, which I haven't received. So I have this pair of white, they're not, they're flip flops, but without the thing between your toe. They're a little, they have a little more support to them because it hurts my feet to wear stuff that's completely flimsy. Anyway, I am going to a Scottish thing on Saturday and I would enjoy having a pair of shoes to wear. I don't. And I don't really have the money to waste buying shoes when I have literally a suitcase full of shoes on a moving truck that's who the hell knows where. Um, anyway, tired of the shoes for sure. Uh, the third thing is I think I have figured out how to quantify why I wanted to move to Florida. Yes, the weather is a big deal to me tired of the snow. I want to live in the tropics, but I think more than that, I was looking for a different lifestyle. I'm working towards that lifestyle now. At least I get to go to the pool most days. I've been to the beach several times since I've been down here. Um, and I intend to go to the beach again and a night launch, which is planned for June 24th. Anyway, I think it was the more relaxed lifestyle that I was looking for. I want to be less uptight about it. And a segue into that for the number four thing is that I need to detoxify from the life that I was living. Uh, and I know that some people are going to be offended by that, but having worked at a law firm for 20 years, not the same one, but in the legal profession for 20 years, I was getting wound more and more tightly. And while I, for most of those years, really loved the work that I did, um, it got to be hyper stressful. And especially in my last situation where I worked, that is a story of its own in case you don't know it. But, um, I walked on eggshells for 10 years at my last job and I broke a lot of eggs and um, I, it was very stressful. So I'm trying to detoxify from that. That's also a part of my wanting to live here. And the last thing that I wanted to say is that I was promised orange trees and orange groves in Florida. I have seen zero orange trees, zero, not one. Apparently they, like everywhere else during expansion, have torn down things that the natives are like, oh yeah, that was a half a mile of an orange grove right there. Okay, well, you can't prove it by me because I literally have seen none. Uh, my friend Jim has talked about stopping along the side of the road to get orange juice and oranges and uh, nope. I'm very disappointed. I'm going to have to actually take a trek to go see an orange tree. That's stupid. Anyway, uh, 
I'm on my way home to have breakfast even though it's 1130 in the morning because I've been I drove for six hours I worked out now I'm gonna go eat thanks for watching respond so I know you're watching bye